Hello! Welcome to my channel, Connection of Lives and Interest. This is Sharon coming to you from my room to create in South Carolina. I have been MIA, missing in action, for going on three weeks because life just happens. And I've been trying to do some stuff, but I'm just now getting back to things. And I was making things for my daughter who just had a birthday. She was coming for a visit, so I had to prepare for that. And then there's also my migraines and things that I've been dealing with. So yeah, I haven't been filming, but I'm trying to get back on track. So thank you for being here watching. Thank you for my new subbies. If you're new to my channel, please leave a comment below that you're new and how you found out about my channel. And those that have been with this journey from the beginning or for a long time, thank you for being here. I have some happy mail and I like to open things in the way that I receive them, but I told, um, this is from Martha Hamilton uh, Granny's house, and most of you know her, and if you don't, um, you definitely got to go check her channel out. She welcomes you into her house, her home, her fridge, all of her drinks, and um, we just love her, along with so many other YouTubers, but um, I, I got this a few weeks ago, and I told Granny that I was expecting some mail that kind of got lost along the way and I like to open things in the order that they came or were supposed to come but um I haven't received that other mail so I'm just going to go ahead and do this but um just so you know I do like to try to open things in the same order that they come so I'm just um and w hello my balloon family is I gotta you know kind of do something with them but uh, Thank you. Okay. So I haven't opened these yet. And I'm going to try to be careful because there's an address on the back of one and not on the other. And these are both from Granny's house. Um, I hope I did everything okay. So look at this pretty, 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 pretty envelope. It's pink with the nice flowers. So um, i going to open it. And look at, oh, isn't that pretty? The best color is rainbow. Isn't that so nice? I love all the colors. Let's see what she's put. Sharon, thank you so much for your lovely entry. I'll have more giveaway after Easter. Sending appreciation, love, and hugs, Granny Martha. Oh, isn't that nice? She actually thanks you for her receiving your entries. I love that. This is um, take two because I accidentally showed the address. So I opened up this first card. I'm going to try to blend these um, videos together. But I showed you that and opened up the card. And then this one is a pretty heart sticker that says friends care and this one is from granny margaret also this looks like it's the back i love the texture and the design i love it it says it has a stamp on here oh i never thought to do that kind of stuff thank you granny martha it says my best friend that's so cute and, it, and she has friends are the greatest inside. And it says, thank you, Sharon, for your thoughtful entry to my giveaway. Love and prayers, Granny Martha. So she sent me two. Isn't that great? I love that. It looks really neat. So thank you, Granny Martha, for your two cards. I appreciate that so much. And um, one thing I was doing when I wasn't up to doing any um, crafting or filming or anything is I, I bought some books and I had some books and I just went through 
to cut off different pictures that I could incorporate into my crafting. And this is pretty funny because if you watched my video with me um, making my photo album for my parents, my dad used to chase us around as kids with uh, live lobsters. And I love tulips. They're my favorite flower. And I know about these things. They're hornworms because if you watch my videos on my tomato plants last year, we had hornworms. I thought they were so cute and amazing until I learned what they do. But yeah, so I wanted to share these ideas with you about getting other options for pictures you use in your cards and happy mail and things. Watermelon, camping, and I also had some other books that were for stencils and I just went ahead and cut out the or tore out and cut out some of the bigger pages in another book because I can use this design, cut out some flowers or hole punch or whatever, and I could use these. These would be great for um, journaling books and stuff. I'm not sure yet if I'll do that. And then there's these little trim things. And when I'm doing stuff, like I, I cut and ripped out pages but they also have the trim up and down the whole page so my thought with this is to go ahead and I'm going to use that too I'm going to cut up the whole length and use this as borders and you can hole punch have a different color underneath I just like to do different things and incorporate all kinds of outside the box kind of stuff so there's there's many different things that I got bulletin board pictures things of kids so I hope that helps you with the idea of going through your old books that you oh I love squirrels in nature so you can go ahead and use that too and I know that um Possum Patty, she loves to do all kinds of stuff with animals and nature and her junk journaling, which I think should be called um, treasure journaling. But, um, yeah. So, that's what i am been doing when I'm not up to doing anything. So, I have some shopping hauls and um, I got some diamond dust. Um, things to share. But for now, I just wanted to share the happy mail from Granny Martha, Martha Hamilton, and what I've been doing when um, I haven't been feeling well, and I, I was determined to get something done towards crafting. Let's see what this one is. Oh, look, see? You can just use that somehow, so I can't wait to see what I'm going to do with it, and I'll be sh sure to share. I don't have any projects that I'm having to work on now. I'm a slow crafter, and I know some of you say that you're slow too, but uh, it just takes me so much longer, but I'm always happy with the end result. So I'm hoping with practice I get better, okay? So I'm going to cut it off now, and I'm going to be working on different things, um, especially getting back to your videos. I haven't been liking watching or commenting because I've been out of commission, but I'm back, I hope. And um, I love and appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you for all your love and support. Thank you for being here. Stay safe, happy, and healthy. Be kind, be nice, be encouraging. Even from our homes through the internet, we can make people smile. We can make people laugh. And we can give an encouraging word and give many different outside the box ideas. And I know many of you that are seasoned crafters don't need these tidbit ideas, but then. There's going to be new ones like myself that, hey, I would have never thought of that. See, and this was a smaller page, but I can just have that for a background of something. So there you have it.
I will be sure to share what I make. Thanks for watching. Bye.